After an almost two-day trip by train, North Korea's Kim Jong-un reached Russia for his first foreign visit in four years and began his meet with President Vladimir Putin. It is highly speculated, though neither side has confirmed or refuted, that the visit is aimed at locking an arms deal between the two countries. Experts state that Russia, which has logged in a long and bloody war in Ukraine, is desperate to secure large quantities of munitions, including artillery shells and bullets, to fire at Ukrainian lines. And such an arsenal of weaponry is one of the few things North Korea can provide. Further, the North has also the capability of producing drones, which has been extensively used in the ongoing war. In return, North Korea aims at getting its hands on Russia's space technology. This comes as North Korea has had several failed space launches and seeks Russia's aid to put its spy satellites into orbit. While improved ties between Russia and North Korea would be a win-win situation for both the countries, a think tank run by South Korea's spy agency explained it poses a problem for the US and its allies. The US has been talking about the probability of an arms deal between the two, as it would further entrench the grinding war in Ukraine and bolster North Korea's nuclear aims. Experts say that with North Korea's arms and ammunition, Russia would be able to continue its war longer.